ever heard that astronauts age slower in space? Sounds like sci-fi. It's actually time dilation. One of Einstein's most mind-bending predictions. Here's the basic idea. According to Einstein's theory of relativity, time isn't a universal tick-tock. How fast it passes depends on your speed and how strong gravity is where you are. Go fast enough or sit in a super strong gravity field and your clock runs slower compared to someone else's. Let's start with speed. Imagine to twins. One stays on Earth. The other zooms near the speed of light on a spaceship. When the traveler comes back, he'll be younger. This isn't hypothetical. Particle accelerators regularly see unstable particles live longer when they're moving fast because their internal clocks slow down. Now gravity, the stronger the gravity, the slower time flows. This is called gravitational time dilation. We V measured it on Earth. Atomic clocks at the bottom of a tower tick a tiny bit slower than clocks at the top. GPS satellites even have to correct for time dilation or your maps would be off by kilometers. Fun bit. In the movie Interstellar, the crew visits a planet near a black hole. Every hour down there equals seven years back on the ship. That scene was based on real physics. Near a massive object. Gravity bends spacetime so much that time almost freezes. So time dilation isn't some abstract theory. It's built into your phone's GPS. It's verified in labs. And it shows that time is flexible, not fixed. A stretchy fabric woven with space. Bottom line, if you want to live longer, you could travel near light speed or hang out by a black hole. But good luck surviving the trip. Still, it's wild to know that time itself isn't universal. It bends, stretches, and slows depending on where you are and how you move.